<clears throat> so, have you watched the best music video of all time? So, welcome back to my channel, Sylvie, and as you see, I am glow up too, I'm speaking in English, and I don't even know I'm Thai. Today, I am going to show you the behind the scenes of the best music video of all time. XL, have you watched it? If you didn't watch it yet, you go watch it now. I don't know where, but watch it now, bitch. I'm so excited about it. And yeah, we had this first single out called XL, which is um, about me, of course. <laughs> it is a story about my life of how I overcome to be an XL in Asia, having extra confidence with an XL buddy in Thailand. How I survived that, how I overcome it. I just don't give a f I just don't give a f So if you want to know what I've been through and stuff, you can go check out my vlog, the Let Me Introduce You to Sylvie. And I look like a monk, but I don't care. This is I'm cool. This is what I think is cool, and I'm gonna do it. Okay? Everything positivity. Everything positivity. Yes. That's the attitude that we want in this channel. I don't know. No, not five. I have to be there on set 7 a.m. Uh, having full on makeup. And to be honest, this is like the very first uh, music video that I got to choose what I want to wear, what I want to look like. Um, what hair, what makeup, because as you know, before when I was an artist, I don't get to choose anything. <laughs> so uh, this is like the first time that I got to choose what story to tell. I have one shot that was long hair, so that was old Sylvie, the old me, back when I was um, 15. 220 that I have to um, fit into the category of being a woman. Like shit, I think I look cooler now. Oh, that was the old Sylvie, but she's gone. She is gone. My favorite looks would have been the white one and the black leather, which I got to show my androgynous. I don't even know I um, pronounce it right. Yeah, just me looking like is she a boy or a girl? Is she a man or a woman? I love that. I love making people confused about me. I feel so powerful wearing that and I feel like so much of myself. And also the white one, I feel like I'm Beyonce. I am Beyonce of Thailand. And I am so confident. Like, I watch myself in the music video, I feel like I hate that bitch. But at the same time, I wanna be that bitch. It's like a feeling where she's too confident to be herself. Um, that's my girlfriend there. And um, she helped me, supporting me all the time. All of the girls here, the cast, is a woman that has been struggling with beauty standards here in Thailand too. As you can see, um, we all have um, body types that are, um, not skinny. For me, XL is not just about being a buddy with XL. In Asia, this is considered XL. We are considered plus sized. It is so hard for you to be different. Um, the size of the clothes, you have less choice of wearing clothes, they don't have your size. They are only available in like S, M or L. So it's it's quite hard in here. It's not like, um, it's not easy like Europe because Europe you have a lot different um, kind of people. But here in Thailand, it's just like all shaped. It is not very open about it. These girls are struggling the same. And I remember one of the girls um, just said that on the fitting day, she told us that, oh my god, I feel like, I feel so relieved being in here and I feel so confident because everyone is just like 
the same people. Like we just put on our outfit and just be yourself, hundred percent confident with not giving a fuck about um, what other people think we're wearing. We see each other's not perfect body, but hell yeah, we have the perfect attitude for it. And it's just like the best moment you can have in this world. I feel so powerful that I could be, that I gather these beautiful women and make them feel a lot more powerful about themselves and just top it, top it, top it. It's like, it's like I made something good to make other people feel good. So that's like a very good feeling to do, to be. I've done good for other people. So it's like, girl, I got your back. And I remember that moment just got me feel like, fuck, this is what I want to do to the world, to Asia, that of course you can be XL and be confident. You can have the attitude of XL, like extra confident with something. I am so overreacting because I fucking love what I can do to the world right now. XL, XL for me is just like a being extra with everything. You can be a size S, but you can have the attitude of XL. That's what I'm trying to say. If you don't love your body, it's okay. But you can have the attitude of an extra confidence, which is XL. You can make your life XL. You can make your your confident XL. Just go extra and just have fun with it. It is a very um, good place to be in, to be in in that moment, and people appreciating you. I can see from the crew's face that. They can see that this is big, this is huge. Because we don't see any artists in Thailand um, doing these kinds of stuff. Uh, we have contents here in Thailand about body positivity, about not body shaming other people, but we don't see it in um, we don't see it in TVs. We don't see it in songs. We don't have. Um, a song that can make you feel something and want you to get out of bed and go do a cartwheel. So this is like a new thing and I'm doing a new thing in Thailand and I'm so fucking proud of myself. <laughs> you, um, this, this blue outfit that I'm wearing, to be honest, before I wouldn't wear that because I feel like this is a freak. I feel like a freak. Why do I have to make myself more like a freak than what I am? But since I've been so confident and I have the attitude of XL, I just feel like when, well, I am a freak, I will always be a freak. Why don't I be a freak XL? Like be a freak 100%. Just go full on with it. Here I come. I overcome my freakness again. I overcome what I feel insecure about myself and just go full on being XL freak. And I feel so fucking great about it. And yeah. Um, yeah, I feel I vibe with these hair more than the long haired one. A music video, like I have never felt 100% happy with all the things I have in the music video. This is like, this is like the time of my life. I have no regrets. I do it a hundred percent. I gave everything that I have from 6 a.m. till 10 p.m. Yeah, I gave it my all. I was tired as fuck, but it is a good tired looking looking again with these girls i mean you can see you can tell that we're having the best time of our lives and i'm so honored to have work with these beautiful girls this is girl 
this is girl power, you guys. I am so grateful for this opportunity that I have from Warner Music Asia that they let me do and share my own stories and in my own way. And also for um, Karma Sound Studio, every people that made this come true. I'm so grateful for everything and holy shit, there's more to come. A lot of songs for you to hear and a lot of freaky vibes, more androgynous thing. Be prepared for what is coming next. Uh, that was the behind the scenes of XL music video. I, I hope you guys enjoyed it and I fucking miss um, talking to camera like this. I will do it often, do it more. So thank you for your support. Thank you for your love that you gave XL and that you gave to me. I am so grateful and I hope this could make you feel a lot more better about yourself. Just a second then. I think I did great if I could do that. So leave a comment on how this track changed your life. I would want to know and come talk to me. We could exchange our thoughts. And thank you everyone for watching. Um, I love you guys. So see you next time. Bye. But I do look like a monk. So uh, am I gonna get bought? Who's about minute?